Good day from the National Weather Service in Missoula, Montana. We have a special weather briefing for you today on Monday, January 27th. Really want to focus on the extended forecast. So for the last several days, as you can see here, we've been under this really strong ridge of high pressure that's been anchored across much of the western U.S., keeping us with these stable and cold conditions locked in the valleys. But there's going to be a big change as we go into this the upcoming weekend. We see a deep trough dropping southward from Canada. And at the same time, we see this extension of the Pacific jet that's going to be bringing moisture into the western U.S. And we are monitoring the potential for a fairly significant uh, snowfall pattern setting up. Higher confidence in the mountains and a little bit lower confidence in the valleys. And one of the reasons for that lower confidence is as this Pacific moisture moves inland, there's a lot of spread with the placement of that moisture. Here we're looking at some different forecast scenarios and scenario one and three really brings in a lot of that heavy moisture right over that cold air as it's dropping south. But you look at some of these other scenarios like cluster two and cluster four, there's a lot less confidence with that deeper surge of moisture and it's also showing that moisture surge really a little bit further south of our area. But the bottom line is we do have high confidence for a lot of mountain snow this is just a graphic of the probability of a, at least a foot or more of snow in the mountains over a 72-hour period and a Monday morning. And you'll really see those higher probabilities of 70% or greater standing out. But also take note that up in northwest Montana, these are the valley areas that we're really monitoring for that collision of Pacific moisture with that Arctic air, cold air that's dropping south out of Canada. The Flathead Valley in particular, we're seeing those elevated probabilities anywhere from 15 to 20%. What about, looking at the timing of that Arctic air, you know, this is looking at Sunday morning. The probabilities of that Arctic front tracking south and west, you'll notice there's a little bit of disagreement between the different ensemble, ensemble systems. But the bottom line is by Sunday morning along the divide, that's where we have the highest confidence for that Arctic air to set up. And that Arctic air will continue to track south and west through the day on Monday. And you, you'll notice that we start to see those higher probabilities into western Montana by Monday morning. That's all we really have for you today. We just want to provide a quick update on the extended forecast and talk about the different scenarios. Stay tuned for, for further forecast updates as we get closer to this storm system. Thank you and have a great day.